Good morning, Drain Team, and here we are in a lovely place called Rock Ferry. And <clears throat> it's not every day you see a speedboat dumped in an old car park. But this is. Uh, this is something that's been here for some time because I've been to this uh, job that I'm going to a few times and I've seen that boat there. It's a lesser uh, effective means of transport in the ocean, a bath, but apparently people have used bath tubs to row themselves across oceans. But there we are guys, a snapshot of the inequalities that are allowed to uh, go unchecked. Anyway, let's get back to it, rant over, hang on, little hammer, plastic hammer. Guys, I know I was on a little bit of a rant, but, you know, it's, it's sad when you, I, I travel all over the place, uh, clearing drains, and there's some areas you wouldn't see, uh, you know, any of this stuff, because the council would be all over it, but down here, they just leave it, uh, and stuff, these people deserve more. They're all decent people. Why isn't the council representing them and, and keeping on top of these areas? Look at the state of this uh, paving. Absolutely disgusting. You know, people, this is a through fair for people to get up to the homes. Terrible. Okay, well that appears to be clear, so uh, I think I need to go inside and ask what's going on. He did tell me the drains were, were blocked outside. Hey guys, simple one. Have a look at it. Oh dear. Yeah. Looks like we've got some uh, congealed sewer sausage in there. So let's just have a little. Get a bucket of water down there to loosen up the sludge in this side, and then I'll see about just breaking that up and it, it hopefully it'll just come okay well anyway that's um that's showing that there's, there's potentially a blockage down down the line there. I know it's not blocked in the other manhole because we know by uh, 
We know that because I just undone the the cover, didn't I? Okay, let's get another bucket in. Here she comes, guys. Sorted. So we just go another rod downstream, and uh, hopefully it will be released. Okay, plan B. It's going downstream, so we'll put the plunger in. I was hoping it would go with just a few buckets of water, but I think we're uh, we're nearly there, aren't we? And yes. Could have got the uh, jet out, but I like, to, I like to use rods occasionally. Beautiful. It's running like a dream now. Shh. Shh. I don't know if you can hear that. Yep. That's the sound of success, baby. So let's get a couple of water, buckets of water, swill, it, uh, swill the manhole out and uh, I think we'll be uh, calling it a day. Okay guys, job done.
Nothing better than the sound of running water in a drain. Beautiful. Guys, I know what you're thinking. You want to see the uh, you want to see the old speedboat again, don't you? Okay, just hang on a second, and I'll show you. patient look at that Okay, let's go. I wonder what the history of this little boat is. It's probably someone's pride and joy once. It may have ended up being parked up here at some point. Till someone nicked its trailer maybe. Uh, nicked its outboard motor. What was its name? Aggravation TPSC uh, TP Tramia Sailing Club. Yeah, powered by Johnson. The old bilge point uh, pump. Port, there'd be a lever on that to pump out any water that gets into the hull. Salvageable, maybe. Yep. There's no holes in it. Okay, guys, there you go. Uh, another. Another job bites the dust.